Hey everyone, I'm Eric. I'm an artist based in the US and today we're gonna draw a cute hot dog together. Let's go. So let's start with a bean. And I think we'll probably put the face on this end. So let's draw two circles here. And these are gonna be our eyes. And let's draw a tiny little nose and then a little tiny rounded W and then a long U, and that's gonna be the mouth. I think I kinda want him looking off to the side as if he might be running away. Now, I think for the bun, let's draw another bean, but this one is gonna be a little smaller. And then the front of the bun on the other side, that would just come off the side of the head here. For the ears, I kind of want him to be running, so let's put them a little bit up above the head, and we'll just draw these sock shapes that'll just come up off the top of his head. Now, for the feet, you can do whatever you'd like. I think I want to have him just sort of running, so let's just draw four circles, and those will be where his feet are, and then we'll attach them to the hot dog body with these parallel lines. And then for the tail, anything's probably fine, but I think I'll go ahead and just draw a normal tail, like a long skinny one. So now we're ready to line our hot dog. So I'm gonna turn the draft layer down on the opacity so we can just kind of barely see it. And then on a new layer above that, we'll go ahead and do our line art. And I'm gonna just work from the front here on the bun to everything that's kind of behind it. And I think we can add a little bit more detail. So I do wanna add maybe his paw pads down here and his toes. And I do think I wanna add the other bun just kind of off to the side there so we can kind of see it on the other side of his body. All right, I think our hot dog is ready for some color. So I'm gonna create a layer that I can paint on. So I'm gonna use my magic wand tool on the layer with my lines and then select everything on the outside of the hot dog and now select everything on the opposite side. That way I can paint just on this section here. On a new layer, I'll go ahead and fill in that selection. So you can see here, we just have this one section here where we can paint just on this part. Now I did bring in a hot dog palette already. So we're gonna use this palette to sort of paint our hot dog. Okay, don't be afraid to make it your own. I'm gonna add mustard. That's actually my favorite condiment. But don't be afraid to add your own details. Maybe mustard isn't your favorite condiment. Maybe it's ketchup. Maybe it's mayonnaise, which I've heard before. But I can't wait to see what you make.